So here we are in mid-Canterbury, standing in a uh, paddock of starfire wheat. We're actually standing in an um, untreated area in the paddock just to demonstrate uh, the diseases that can occur and what we do to actually control them. And in the base of this crop here, you can see that there's been quite a lot of septoria and it's actually moved up through the crop and we're finding it in the upper leaves. So that inoculum will sit there and uh, if we don't control it, that just carries on right through the life of the crop and it can be very devastating in terms of yield. So yield's coming from the upper part of the plant, so it's very important to keep that clean. So it means that your uh, T2 timing at uh, GS39 when the flag leaf is out is very important. So looking out into the paddock, you're not seeing this sort of thing that we are here, where we've actually got um, disease on the lower leaves, but actually also spreading up through the canopy. If we look out into the treated area, it's had a, uh, a fungicide on at T1, which in this case was Prezaro, it'll lead it to the heat deer. That's uh, going to reduce the inoculum. You can see that the pignidia haven't developed on those leaves as they ha have here, and that's reducing the inoculum for, for later in the crop cycle. And again, so the uh, key time will be when the flag leaf comes out, and we'll need to come back in and put on a, um, appropriate fungicide at that stage.